How about Bob Myers giving the Knicks a vote of confidence? A lot of fans were into this. They were into this a lot. Mm. Uh, Bob Myers, man, says that uh, people may not have wanted to play in NYC, and I think that's changed. I think now you're looking at murmurings, hearing things. Hey, how about the Knicks? So a little vote of confidence, a little, hey, if things go south with the CAA guy, I might be available for the right price, the right bag. I thought that was a good move. Good political move by Bob Myers there. And making Knicks fans very happy that a guy with four rings is giving us a ring and endorsement. This got a lot of attention on it on uh, KFTV Instagram. A lot of attention. Hey, Bob Meyer. Leader yeah. that that Warriors dynasty, man, as you noted. Four rings. Yeah. Giving kudos to how the Knicks are building, rebuilding this team. And how can you blame him? Look, this team in the past two of the three seasons of the Tom Thibodeau has gone to the playoffs. They got out of the first round. Remember the whole controversy of like, oh, it's all over if the Knicks don't get Donovan Mitchell. Yep. Oh, Cleveland is that much better. Gentlemen swept. Not even an issue for the New yep. York Knicks. Mitchell Robinson dominated the Twin Towers. Jalen Brunson made light work out of Donovan Mitchell. Darius Garland wasn't an issue. Look, how can you not like where the New York Knicks are going right now? Continuity has been the big buzzword around this team. They're doing a good job, man. They're doing a good team. job. It's just, it's just waiting waiting for that yeah. next big move is it going to be someone like joel Embiid? who is a star to come to new york to really push this team over the top or is there somebody on this roster that hasn't surfaced yet yeah that's the question they're they're, they're going about it the right way uh, i think they are they are primed and ready to make a move when that whenever that move happens it's not easy it's not easy on the put all your chips in the middle side. It's not easy from the just develop and develop and, and, and do it patiently. You got to get luck. It has a lot to do with this thing, man. Look at what the Nets did in, in putting, they had Katie Kyrie Harden, Simmons, da, 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 flopped out. You know, it, it doesn't look at what's going on in Philly. That's about to man, burn out. Put some respect on DeAndre Jordan's name. <laughs> It's not easy, man, you know? So I think where they are, they've been patient at this thing. You have the draft picks, even though they haven't drafted in two years. (laughs) Even though they haven't drafted in two years. They still have the war chest. Look at the salaries. The salaries are looking good. Yep. Looking manageable. And they have young players with some promise. Maybe, you know, quick and grimes. And we'll see what RJ does. Mitch is holding it down, the elder statesman. It's a young team. They're scrapping for Tibbs. They got good chemistry. What's not to like? No drama. What's not to like right now? They're competitive. The no- 47 wins last year. What's not the to no like? No drama is the big thing. The no drama is the big thing. Because yeah. there's always, Knicks were always in the tabloids for the wrong reason. Well, they got no um, egos in the locker room. Yeah, man. That's that's And that's a great thing. And it looks like we got a bunch of guys who are all about playing basketball. Solid leadership. Yeah. Um, the difficult thing, as you talked about, man, is like, when do you push in your chips? You'll get that guy, right? It's like, there's always that fear of like injury, chemistry. Um, are they bought in? There's all of that. And then yeah. for the development side, it's like, we're talking about timelines of making sure that everyone lines up, right? Brunson, Grimes, quickly, all these other guys, different ages, man. Yeah. Um, and then contracts are going to be the same thing, too, because you got to pay Brunson. You know, if Randall's still here, he's looking to get a bag too, right? Quickly, mm. looking for his extension. You're going to have to pay Grimes if you want him to stay on this team. And you know Tibbs loves Grimes. There's just a lot to go around, man. Yeah. And look, if you still want Isaiah Hartenstein, this is the last year of his contract too. And he's probably going to say, hey, man, look what I contribute. Look how I, look how I managed to improve my game to be on this roster. I deserve to get paid too. Yeah. It's going to be tough.